My name is Shane Berg and I am the Chief Forester for the Province of British Columbia. British Columbia's forests are a special resource. Renowned by both British Columbians and visitors around the world for their unique qualities and critical influences to the ecosystems throughout the province. From the magnificent towering red and yellow cedar and coastal Douglas fir along BC's western rainforests to the interior pine and spruce forests in the drier interior and the vast boreal forests in the north. These ecosystems are not only uniquely diverse, they are also important for carbon storage, timber supply, hydrology, wildlife habitat, recreational opportunities, and their significant cultural importance to Indigenous communities. Since the 1950s, the BC government has invested in tree improvement programs aimed at regenerating new forests that are both productive and resilient. Ministry of Forests researchers and forest practitioners select the best trees, exhibiting qualities and attributes that will improve the survival, growth, and resilience of our new forests in an effort to respond to our current climatic changes. So in our reforestation programs in the past, we were trying to make trees that were growing bigger and faster. And now we have taken those same methods and we're using them to try to grow trees that are healthier and more resilient to the climate. In BC, we go through a huge amount of effort to make sure that the trees that we're using for reforestation are as resilient as possible. And the way that we do that is that we identify trees in the wild that may have some sort of characteristics we like. They grow really well. They seem to be tolerant to drought, whatever it might be. On those trees, we pick the cones off them, which have seeds inside. And we take those seeds, we grow them into seedlings, we plant those seedlings out into research trials in the forest. So every tree that we like, we have hundreds of seedlings from them that we're testing in different environments and we monitor those seedlings, we measure them, and we use that to say, well, this tree's really good, this tree's not so good. And then we take the trees that we like and we take little cuttings of them and we graft them into a seed orchard, which is what we have behind us here. And these are the actual trees that are all pollinating each other and producing the millions of seed that we use to reforest every year. The end result is that we want to end up with trees going in the ground that are resilient to the climates of both today and the future moving forward. And we do that through testing in our field trials. We do that through picking parents to go into our breeding programs. We do that through going out and collecting seed from the wild from areas that are warmer and drier so that we can use those to plant into a warmer and drier future. Innovation is at the core of our reforestation efforts. Through research and science-based selection and testing strategies, we're helping create forests that are more resilient and matched to the sites that we hope to regenerate for a host of objectives. The Ministry of Forests' commitment to support sound stewardship through the delivery of exceptional research and science ensures that our forests are carefully managed today and for generations to come. I hope you'll all take a moment to reflect on the importance of the forests to not only your lives, but to those of British Columbians around the province. Have a great National Forest Week.